What's good, y'all? It's your boy Chosen One with two guns, repping that EMZ bitch TV. We got N Y O. I said N Y Y N W Melly and Y N W Bortland, Bortland. So now they saying that they are uh, as a deputy murder. They trying to hit these guys with a deputy murder. Allegedly, a deputy got shot and killed, right? And they're trying to tie him into it. But the crazy shit is that, right? The way the deputy got killed, right? Like they saying that it was in a it was in a shooting, right? But whoever was doing the shooting, they was shooting at like the ops or some shit like that, like two blocks away from where the where the cop was at. You know, I think the cop must have been eating like a jelly donut, or, you know what I mean, or one of them French coolers or some shit like that from Dunkin' Donuts, right? Then he caught one to the top. But anyway, yeah, like, so this shit wasn't even meant for him. Like, this shit crazy. This shit wasn't even meant for him. Now they tying that shit to the YNW crew. You feel me? So, what? but what I'm thinking is, is that why now? Because this guy, this cop deputy was murked like a minute ago, you know what I mean, did, he got murked actually before the double homie with the, with the NW, <laughs> and the, with the YNW crew, you know what I mean, so he was killed before them two dudes got killed, so my thoughts is, why now, why now, because I think, right, when Borland got caught going to the store to get them Lucy's and shit, right, Melly turned himself in, Right? What happens when you got to turn yourself in? Or they come, what is it? A warrant, right? It's usually warrant. And what comes with a warrant? Motherfuckers going to go where? Right in your crib, nigga. They going to go in your crib. They, yo, look, the cops be dying to go in a nigga house. You know? If, if you driving, they'll be dying to get in your car. If you out there they're trying to get in, they, they dying to get in your crib. They want to get in your crib very bad. Because most niggas, be, most niggas get, get found guilty off of evidence that be in their house. Like, motherfuckers be so stupid, right? Like, a lot of motherfuckers, they'll still have, like, the clothes they wore the day they did the bullshit. You know? Like, they'll still have, the fa they'll still have like, the ski masks. They still even, they still might have the guns. They still might even have the shell casings in their crib. All types of dumb shit motherfuckers be doing after they be doing their gangster shit, you feel me? It's like motherfuckers don't be watching the the, the news, like, like niggas don't be watching, like, you know them from forensic shows and shit like that, like, this shit crazy, bro. But yeah, man, like I'm saying, like, it's either they found, it's either the boys found some evidence at one of these guys' cribs, or maybe they found evidence at both Melly and Bortling crib, right? Either that, or I'm thinking... When Borland got bagged outside getting them bogeys, right? The cops must have interrogated him and told him, like, look, we know y'all lying. We know y'all drove around with the bodies for a little minute. We know this and that, right? Just tell us the truth what happened. You know, if you if if you gave us some info, we could do this or this or that, right? So maybe, I'm just saying maybe, you know. That's even if these guys even have something to do with that. That's why I would say allegedly, right? So, let's say, let's just say that Borland told, right? Borland was like, let's just say Borland was like, you know what? Uh, I know about that deputy that got, that got murked. Uh, that, I don't know when it was exactly, but, but let's just say he was like, I know about that deputy that got murked, that cop, that cop. You know what I'm saying? If them niggas, if he knew so anything about that, Right, and he was to tell the Jakes that he knows something about that, you know. I'm pretty sure he could probably get to slide off off that double homie shit if he was to turn Melly in on that cop killing shit. That's if Melly even had something to do with that. It could have been somebody else, you know. This is just my opinion, y'all, because I'm thinking like, why now? Because this cop died a little minute ago, you know. He would, he died before the the other two dudes from the crew died. 
You know, so like I'm saying, like why now? Why now? Because they got evidence, nigga. They got some type of evidence. They must have found some shit in these guys' house, or maybe they got some type of phone record or some shit like that. Or maybe, maybe they put two and two together on a on on, on both of their interview. You know what I mean? When they when 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 they I said interview when they interrogated them. You know, maybe maybe when they interrogated Melly, they took a piece out of Melly's shit, and when they interrogated. Portland, they took a piece out of Portland and shit, and just put them shits together, and was like, you know what, these motherfuckers probably had something to do with the, with the deputy getting murked, you know, a minute ago, you know, and if these motherfuckers had, like, the shell casings in their crib from the same gun that they probably did allegedly with the body of the deputy, bro, they feeling get smoke, I'm telling you that, fuck Trying to make it out of jail, nigga. These niggas gonna have to fight to to not get the death penalty, nigga. That's what they gonna have to fight for. Fuck coming home to your kid, nigga. You gonna have to fight to not get that death penalty, to not get that motherfucking shot in your ass. Or 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 I heard some states they still do the 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 the, the shooting shit. Word is born. I heard. I don't know if it's true, but I heard they still do that. That, that shit that they do back in the day, how they how they line your ass up next to the wall and they'll get like ten niggas, ten cops to shoot you, but uh, but the the cops won't know which one of the one really was the one that which one of the one was the bullet that killed them. You know that type of shit. I I heard some cities do that, but I heard I, but then I heard that a lot of them don't. So if they do do that, it's probably just one state out of the fifty states in America. But anyway. Yeah, I was just thinking about that shit like, damn, bro, you know, because finding out about that deputy getting murked, it's like, how the fuck, how the fuck did they, not, why would they think he had something to do with that, though? Because that was on a whole nother day. That was a whole nother date. You know what I'm saying? Why would they think that Melly had something to do with that? Or Borland, why would he think that Borland had something to do with that? Because maybe Borland said some bullshit when they, when they found his ass on the block. You know, or maybe when they raided their crib, like I said, maybe they found us, maybe they had a ski mask up in there they probably used, or maybe they got caught on camera, or it could be a lot of shit, man, you know, it, it's 2019, man, they got satellites up there, they looking at niggas, that's another thing too, a lot of motherfuckers think that just because they weren't a mask and they'll be 100% all right, nah, nigga, with them satellites, bro, if they really want to get your ass bad, they check them satellites and shit, and they'll GPS shit and all this shit, and they'll rewind shit, and they will get your ass from the minute you stepped out your crib that day of the shooting to whatever the fuck you came back to your crib, and they will figure it out most likely. Who did what, and where, and how, you know? So it's just crazy. Like, they really about to pin this shit on Melly, but I feel so bad for this nigga, man. You know, he a young dude, man. He young, rich, and finally get to the bag. And, and now he gonna have to fight to not get the death penalty, bro. Like, this shit crazy, man. This shit this shit just getting crazy and crazy. This shit remind me of TK. This shit really remind me of TK. But TK ain't murk no cop, though. You feel me? TK ain't murk no cop. TK, TK and, and his boys, it was like three of them out there doing a the bullshit or some shit like that. Like three niggas, you know? But it, in this case, it was just Melly and Borland. So it's only two guys. You feel me? It's only two guys. You got you know them. So it's like, you know? But what y'all think, though, man? Let me know, man. Let me know if y'all think Melly or Borland did this shit. Or y'all think maybe they trying to set them up just to cop out to it or whatever. You know? Like, I, 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 I doubt it. I doubt. I strongly doubt. Melly had anything to do with murking no damn cop. I, I doubt it. I doubt that motherfucker is out there just shooting shit up all wild and crossfire all over the place and deputy get hit in the head. Like, I doubt it, bro. Like, you, you rich like that and you out there just busting your guy in the middle of the street, even if you ain't trying to hit at the ops or whatever. But damn, like, you know, you got, that's what, that's what you got boys for. That's what you got your niggas for, you feel me? They put in, you supposed to get your niggas to put in that work, you feel me? You know, you got the bag. They supposed to protect you. Niggas are supposed to protect the bag. This what a lot, this what a lot of OGs say. A lot of OGs, you supposed to protect the bag. You don't let the bag do the bullshit. 
Cause then the bag end up in jail. The bag end up in jail. How the fuck is everybody gonna get out? You know, niggas need lawyers and shit like that. You feel me? But like I said, it's only boiling and Melly. It's only two guys that are that are looking at this shit. It's not ten motherfuckers. It ain't a gang of niggas. It's just them two. You know. So, yeah, man. You know. Shout out to Melly, man. I, I hold your head, bro. You feel me? I hope. I really hope you ain't had nothing to do with that, bro. So, so they don't hit your ass with that chair, bro. You feel me? Cause I know you got a family too. Borland got a family too. But this shit just crazy, man. Let me know what y'all think. Y'all think that motherfucker really has something to do with that, or y'all think, y'all think the boy just just planting shit? They, you know what I'm saying? Planting shit on niggas and shit like they're doing the movies or whatever. But yeah, man, it's EMZ, man. If I, f I find out any new shit, y'all already know I'm coming back. 100.